Minority in Parliament has condemned in the strongest terms the murder of undercover team member of Tiger Eye PI, Ahmed Hussein Swale. The 31-year-old was shot dead around 10 p.m. last Wednesday by unknown assailants. At a news conference in Accra, the ranking member of Parliament for Defence and the Interior, Mr. James Agalga, said per Section 20 of the Criminal and Other Offences Act 1960, Act 29, the utterances of the Member of Parliament for Asin Central, Mr. Kennedy Ejepon, cannot be swept under the carpet. The minority says the behaviour of Mr. Kennedy Ejepon is inappropriate and unparliamentary and called on the government to hold him accountable for his actions. The right to life is a universal right. And so that same right that we have provided for in our constitution is also a right that is enjoyed in any part of the world. And so when a journalist loses his life because of his work through the abetment of a sitting member of parliament, that behavior becomes one of international concern. Like we have said time with that number, this is not the first time Kennedy Japan has made those outbursts. This time around, his actions have actually resulted in the loss of one of your colleagues. And you think that the U.S. congressman should not speak. That man is a champion of international human rights. Without saying that, I mean, I can assure you, we will never break the law, but we will try to look at other ways of getting our colleague punished. I know, people may say, uh, well, if you vote in Parliament, where else can he be punished? But I can tell you, we have come up with something that we know. If others help, he could be punished through those other means without necessarily Parliament punishing him. But it is our hope that Parliament will take advantage of this time and get our call. Because you see, it is not about the murder case. To move to the next, okay. it is not about the murder. I mean, I can never sit here and say that Honorable, uh, my colleague Kennedy Paul has hand in this. I am judging him by his utterances. And those utterances itself offend the rules of this house and of uh, the rules of this country. It is on that basis. So we are not interfering in any way with what the police will be doing. We are saying that we are members of parliament. We are supposed to hold ourselves in very, 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 very high standard procedures in everything that we do. You cannot be a member of parliament and want to be put on the same pedestal with your constituent. That's why they queue to elect you. You are supposed to lead by example. You are supposed to be courteous. That's why we are called we are we are called honored. Because you've honored us by electing us. So I cannot behave like you. So things that my constituents will do and get away with, I should not get away with. Unfortunately, somebody has lost his life to do that. But we cannot say that he has hands in the killing. The police should continue doing their work, but we think that this house must act so that it prevents me, it prevents all other members of parliament from taking the course that our colleagues are taking.